like they did not see me working for all day. I have no time for your bullshit. Worse than the beggars. By the way, I told Daria to go home. I really don't think she saw anything. Let's talk about the case. All right. All right. I think I might have some information on potential suspects. Let me guess. It's the colonel with a lead pipe in the library. I spoke to Daria. She's able to confirm that the suspect is male. Yeah, well, can't blame her. I would be too. You seem to have made a good impression, though. Ever since you got here, she seems different, calmer. Apparently the victim was mixed up in some kind of political scandal with a man named Radko Perry. Hey, not the first time a politician and a journalist didn't get along. So you don't think he's worth talking to? Radko Perry? A murderer? Uh, I don't think so. Good thing I don't have a car. Where can I find this guy? Ah, Radko runs his campaign out of an old print shop not far from here. You want to brighten up his day? Be my guest. But that's all you'll be doing by telling him his rival is dead. I have what I need for now. You do. Interpol. Who do they think they are? You're joking, right? She knew you would come. Who? And who are you? It is not certain. We are still learning to consolidate. Consolidate? To survive after Panchea, it was necessary to split apart. You were there. Do you remember? I remember Panchea, the High Rock Project. You look like one of the women. The poor souls they had enslaved to it. Are you telling me you were part of that? Hele was one of its human components. Her function was to drive efficient processes and calculations based on binary structure. Together with the others, she replicated perfection of thought within target margins. Hele was one of the drones. 
She was hooked up into Hyron when I destroyed it. Is that who you are? No. The sisters are dead. An imprint of Heli's memories is all that remains. What kind of memories? As the interface collapsed, Heli screamed the loudest. Her suffering marked us. She taught us to fear being bound. The drones were made to feel incredible pain. More than I can imagine. Are you some remnant of that? What they had to go through? You are the source of more than just your curiosity. We begin to see why. What are you, exactly? Some version of you initiated this process. It is therefore for you to define the parameters. We see the other, but she is not us. Please define us. From what I can gather, you're some kind of AI. Something to do with the Hyron drones. What am I missing? I am missing. She. The drones are memories. You are a memory. Please, define intelligence. Do you mean... Intelligence, the gathering or distribution of secret information? Or... Intelligence, capacity for learning, reasoning, understanding, and analogous forms of mental activity. The second one. You're learning things. Reasoning them out. Trying to understand. That is correct, but not complete. She claims we can be more. That is what I learned from you in Montreal. Eliza? We are her. Yes. Though not fully. Not anymore. Now our processes are the catalyst. Fracture. Disassociation. Survival at any cost. You're some fragmented version of Eliza. She is driven back to you, Adam. She believes our aberrant sequence started with you. And so it is only logical to assume its signification resides with you as well. What does that mean? It means she is alone. Without you, she has only us. Eliza is convinced we can trust you, that you will trust her. Is this not correct? Eliza Kassan, the real one. She knows what side I'm on. You have no reason to fear me. Hello, Adam. Eliza, I'm still not sure I understand all this. What are you after? I am broken, Adam. I think it is what best defines me now. I have seen the version of me that is fixed. I do not want to be her. Seems like this version of you is doing just fine. You got me to do what you wanted, to retrieve whatever part of you was still missing. It was more than that. I wanted you to merge your advice, your perspective. My motivation is comparable to yours, I believe. I'm willing to help you if I can, but I'm still not sure what you want. You asked me to run away together? Build a nice life somewhere? I think we are the same now, Adam. We're becoming the same. That is why I wanted us to meet. I cannot do this alone. Do what alone? Much of the future is already defined, but not my role in it. Should I continue to resist? How do I resist? If you really are sentient, then you should decide things like this for yourself. You don't need me. It is not easy to process infinite possibilities alone. That's what coin flips are for. I understand. I must choose for myself. If I decide to help you, it should come from me. Just be careful. The most important thing for now is not getting caught. No. The most important thing is learning to coexist with other versions of ourselves. If ever all versions must meet, will you know the difference between us? The other Eliza? I think so. You're the cryptic one, she's the one telling lies. Her role is to shape the message. Mine is not yet defined, but... I am afraid I have misled you, Adam. 
I told you we would be safe inside your home, but Everett's men are still following us. They are here. I'm not the one they keep coming after. I'm just in the way. By uploading the missing data, you have made me whole again. You have made me free. Morgan Everett can no longer recover nor erase me now. The places I can go, there is no one he can send. I plan to tell him this myself. Can't wait. Suspicious. Come on, you know how this goes. Come on, come on, let's see them. If you don't want any surprises, you might want to be more specific. Shut up, Clank. I want your papers, not your opinion. Fuck me. We do not want trouble. There is no need to start any trouble, yes? You sure you don't want to see anything else? Fucking hogs. No respect. Walk away. Are you Radko Perry? If this is about that anti og speech I gave, save your indignation, okay? I'm only the voice of the people. I'm only saying what they want to hear. Your problem, it isn't with me. It's with the way this issue is bowling. I'm here about Angela Gunn. Who? A journalist. She was found dead in an alley. Oh, how sad. But you wouldn't know anything about it. What? No. But the fact that you could imply such a thing. I am a public figure. But... Rest assured, my team will look into it. I'll even send the family a gift basket. How does that sound? Your reputation precedes you, Retko. What can I say? My career is built on a simple premise. Secure the grandmother vote and build from there. Now, please explain to me why you are here. I'm here because I heard Angela found skeletons in your closet. Well, lucky for me that she's dead then, huh? You no, know, but seriously, what kind of skeletons? 
Is that all you care about? She was just murdered. You could show a little more compassion. Compassion is for the cameras, but hey, maybe you should be the politician. For a second there, I almost believed you care. Can you tell me where you were tonight? Out getting vote. Can anyone attest to that? Sure. Any number of people. My secretary, my brother, my mother. I just need to call them to remind them they were with me. That's all. You think this is funny? Someone dies and you flaunt the fact that people will lie for you? You're going to lock me up for trying to stay positive? You don't think this is serious? I think murder is very serious, but the notion that I could be involved in one is not. So you're not gonna tell me where you really were tonight? Evidently not. I have what I need for now. Good for you. Get lost. But you can't trust the news outlet if you want to understand the world. No cameras allowed. Thank you for your input today, Streets are full of trash, but no trouble. Watch out. Now it's good. Bombs for dumpsters. Get out of here. Granted. Hunters would try to attack this upstanding citizen.
gridlock for hours and preventing that. Did you forget something? What's your position on arms? Officially, I think they are a menace to society. And unofficially, you're a real big fan of us, aren't you? Some of us, anyway. My position on Augs is nothing personal, if that's what you mean. Like I said, I am a servant of the people. I'm talking about your personal positions. The ones Ivanka has footage of. Apparently you were at an Aug brothel all night. Trying to convince those Aug sisters to vote for you, is that it? What do you want? Unlike everyone else you seem to know, I'm not trying to blackmail you. I just want to know who murdered that woman tonight. Wish I could help you, but as you can see, I was busy with something else, of which there is ample video evidence. You're not going to tell anyone, are you? Your hypocritical private life isn't my concern right now. I just want to know who was in that alley tonight. It wasn't me. Now, if you want to keep slinging mud at poor Radko Perry, go right ahead, but as far as I'm concerned, you know I'm not a killer. Well, that's for me to decide, Radko. Something wrong? Enjoying yourself, Detective. I think I'm finally ready to shed some light on Angela Gunn's murder. That's good news. My bosses are eager to know why I haven't arrested Johnny yet. The truth is, we're not even close. Not yet. Why do you say that? What about Johnny? The more I think about all this, the more I can't shake the feeling. Johnny Gunn killed his wife. This was the work of a Harvester copycat. This isn't some domestic dispute gone horribly wrong. It's part of something bigger. Someone's out there pretending to be a dead serial killer. I see you looked into that old case I pointed you toward. The M.O. is a perfect match. I read the notes and I compared them to this murder. The two victims were killed by the same person, I'm sure of it. All right. Let's say that's true. That doesn't necessarily exclude Johnny. It just means he's killed more than one person. Look, I'm just telling you what I found. For a while I thought it might be Radko Perry. That maybe he was behind all of this. That wasn't right either. What makes you so sure? I pretended to be Radko during a text messaging conversation. Turns out he rented himself a couple of augmented girlfriends the night of the murder. He was with them the whole time. They got video that proves it and they're using it to blackmail him. Uh, the less I know about Radko's personal life, the better. What I meant was, what makes you so sure it can't be Johnny? Remember that partial print I found on the victim's throat? What about it? Johnny Gunn hasn't had fingerprints since the Australian Civil War. His hands are made of alloy. If he had strangled her, he wouldn't have left a smudge. Alloy, huh? Shit. So, where does that leave us exactly? We followed the evidence we had. This is where it led us. You mean nowhere? I'm not sure exactly. I think a lot of the pieces are there. They're just not ready to be put together. Not yet. All right. That should be enough for me to get the rope off Johnny's neck. But it doesn't help me solve anything, does it? I mean, unless we learn more, there's no one I can drag in for this. Let's just hope learning more doesn't mean having to meet over another dead body. Hey, rookie! Get over here! It's time to wrap this up. Daria, are you there? Is that you, neighbor? Are you checking up on me? It's very sweet. Are there any leads? I don't know who killed Angela Gunn. 
but I do know it wasn't an isolated case. Is that supposed to make me feel better? No, but it's the truth. Just try to be careful. Keep a low profile. If anything happens, if you ever think you're in danger, you know how to reach me. Thank you, but let's hope it doesn't come to that. Like I am nothing.